Hey guys, and welcome back to the Binding of Isaac Rebirth with me, Hollow. We are doing a new challenge run, playing the Darkness Falls, which was one of the most requested in the last comments. Jesus Christ, I look horrifying. Alright, spacebar item. Awful. Do not like that spacebar item. I'm Eve, it would look like. I think I have pentagram. I got fear shot, which is damage upgrade, and we have a sacrificial dagger. We are hor horror Babylon because we're Eve, yeah, we do have Fear Shot, we have the Sacrificial Dagger, we have Pentagram, yeah. Alright, so everything looks pretty great, great apart from the fact that I have Dead Bird and our Spacebar item. Damage-wise, we're looking good, our movement speed looks really nice. I wonder how far we actually have to go in this one, though. Um, I think someone said in the comments something like, this is a good Satan run. So, ah, that was really dumb. Um, I suppose it's probably going to take us to Satan. I, I guess that's where we're going. Either way, I'm going to stab them with the, the obble. Despite us having, like, Pentagram and uh, Fear Shot, which is two separate upgrades that increase your damage in some way, we're having to, like, really hit these guys a lot. Um... I must say, maybe it's because I did that uh, lost run recently in which I was doing so much damage and so I'm like, I'm miscounting damage lately. If we can see on Monstro's health, you know, how much damage am I actually doing to him? It's not actually that much. Why is it not that much? Okay, what's scary about Monstro and Fear Shot is when he jumps when he's feared, he jumps weirdly, you know? He'll go a weird way. So it's kind of scary when he does that. We want to try and avoid that if we can. Um, just be wary of it. Don't run over to him when he jumps. Oh, see? See what I mean? I mean, he's running away from us, so just be ready for that. Just uh, just be wary of that. Either way, we, we killed him pretty quick, didn't we? There's no denying that we definitely do have good damage. You know, it's good. Speed and range up is good. Um, but, yeah, we're not we're not really getting much from it. Uh, I feel like we're not going to get any item rooms. I, I'm going to go check, just in case. Plus, you know, maybe I'll get a bomb. There's tinted rock laying around there. Maybe, maybe a small rock I could get. There's a bomb. Can't get it, though. Can't get it, though, can I? Fuck's sake. Alright, that fear shot lasted a while. That was scary. Fuck's sake. <laughs> it's teasing me. It's teasing me with bombs. So teasing me with bombs. Alright, I'm one hitting these, but you know, you normally wouldn't hit these. There we go. Alright, so we go up here. Use the bomb. We blow up that. Get two bombs. Right? Then we blow up that. Maybe get a secret room. Don't get a secret room, but we get the bomb, whatever. Alright, cool, cool. And then there's the soul heart to get. But first, let's face pride. Okay. Uh, half health. The, the, the damage is alright. There's no... I think the damage is alright. It'll do. But I would like to get more. Whoa! <laughs> well, that's kind of dumb, isn't it? I'm going to just use one so I can take the other and save it. Uh, yeah, two diamonds there. Not, not hilariously... Hilariously amazing. Oh, yes! The damage up. The damage up. Just what we were looking for. Just what we were looking for. So yeah, we can press the space bar in boss fights or whatever to make it do us do more damage, but I just don't like the item in general. I don't like spending money um, like that. All right, so two diamonds is going to be kind of uh, important. That's quite the good bomb because it's going to get a tinted rock and also get us to a chest. All right, we've got a bomb back for it. Really hoping for the soul hearts for deals with the devil, to be perfectly honest with you. Wow, okay, all right. Keys and bombs. Got them. We got them. We got bombs, we've got keys, we've got bombs, and we've got keys. What more could you want? Well, I mean, I suppose there's a few things. <laughs> Alright, careful, 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 just keep moving. I got my really insane movement speed, I must say. I'm moving very quickly. Can we get the rocks? Damn, damn. Uh, shop there, no real point. Uh, again, we're going to get as much money as we can, and then diamonds. Diamonds it up, see what we get. This should hit it, should hit it. Yeah, and there's that soul heart we're looking for, we're begging for, we're fighting for. We got it. God, the movement speed is really, like, awesome and scary at the same time. And I can get to that without taking damage. Is it worth it? No, when I've got the soul heart to sort of, sort of need and protect and whatnot. It's only Larry Jr., you know, whatever. Um, I, don't, I definitely aren't going to press the space bar item. We're just going to be very, very careful here and try to use our first shot to our advantage. You know, whatever. There we go. Nearly finished one off now. Careful. Careful, they don't really know which way they want to go a lot of the time. There we go. And now when there's just one left, it should be a simple case of finish him, finishing him off. But it's a bit annoying when he's got fear shot. Despite my insane movement speed, my, my attack speed's quite bad. Ah, range up's pointless. Uh, it's a better space bar item. It's a better space bar item. And it's one of three of Guppy. I prefer this. It's going to be more damage than uh, 
that, and as you've seen, I've not actually used it once. And now I've got Horror Babylon active, so yeah. Maybe that's why my damage didn't feel that great. In fact, yeah, that's, that's why my damage didn't feel great. Specifically, that is the reason. Um, I am Eve, so my starting damage is god-awful, but I do get Horror Babylon. So when Horror Babylon's not active, I have really bad damage. So now that we've got uh, one red heart, we have Horror Babylon. Uh, we're not going for a boss rush, so sure. Full health. Well... Good to know it's in the rotation, I guess. How are we doing on money? Well, we have four, the potential of four coins, but I'd definitely rather wait till we have, like, I don't know, 15 or something and get 30 and just be sort of sorted for a long time. He's doing that move a lot, isn't he? Down he goes, down he goes. At the very least, I have these sexy red heels on now. So, that's one good thing. <laughs> careful, careful, the Larry Juniors. Man, well, we faced a monstro and we faced a Larry Junior, and now we faced another monstro and another Larry Junior. Not Larry Jr., just Larry. Alright, well. I guess that's it. We could go to the... Well... Blau, Soul Heart for... Yeah, go on. Go on. Go on. Regret. Regret! Yeah, great. Re just great. <laughs> just regret. Straight up regret. Uh, that is my overall, like, response and opinion on that. I wish I had two bombs. Wish I had two bombs. No. No, no, no. No, 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 no. Let's not do that. Let's go down to the next floor. It'll be cool. We'll be fine. We'll go to the next floor. Okie doke. Third floor. Should probably pay attention to how far we actually have to go in this front. It's just useful information to just have and know. Um, and maybe I'll I'll think about doing that. You know, think about looking that up and just on the next floor when I uh, skip to the next floor. Let's have a quick glance. No. No. Maybe, but no, no right now. So, I guess attack speed is what I'd like. Uh, my damage is obviously pretty good um, for what we've got. Uh, more damage I'd accept. You know, there's no denying that. I'd like more money and more, more damage and all that. But um, out of everything, I think the most impactful thing that we could get would probably be tears up. Because right now our shot speed's alright. You know, it's pretty good. But uh, it's sort of counterbalancing our shots themselves. So... There's more of a gap between each shot, so if we get tiers upgrades, then uh, that'll counter that, and then we'll be doing more damage, and in general, we'll be a stronger character. Careful, careful. Alright, keep my eyes open for them tinted rocks, may have missed some. Not paid attention for the couple of rooms. Get plenty of flyers going here, it's really nice. The reason for that is I'm destroying the enemies before they can even get to me, um, therefore the flies aren't really doing anything. There we go, they're gone now, they're gone now, but they're back. Ooh, oh god, I really want to do that. I got the keys for it. Just need a second bomb. Just need a second bomb. You're a bit annoying, to be honest. You're a bit of a pain, but uh, I think we can deal with you. I think we can we can hang. We can we can hang and handle you, and so on and so forth. Come on now. Let's die. Let's just die now. Come on. There you go. Stop crying. Die. There we go. Uh, bad item in general. And Krampus. I guess I would want coal. Ah, yeah. We want coal. We want coal. Call is call, 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 call. Balls. Balls. All right, so Krampus' head over the uh, flies. Yep. Yep. I just would have preferred call because it would have been more effective. We had an okay spacebar item. We were doing okay with a spacebar item. We really didn't need more than what we had. All right, looks like we're going to be using our diamonds card here. Let's just open this box. Get some stuff, you know. Get some stuff. Soul heart, bomb. Uh, range up, good, I guess. Tower, mmm. Yeah, we can actually do something good with this tower, can't we? No, no, it backfire. It was on the last floor where I would have had a good tower. Um, don't want that trinket, it's just going to backfire. Weekly Worm, we have the bombs for this. Uh, Tinted Rock, definitely worth it. Could be an item in here as well. And, you know, Soul Hearts, keys, whatever. Soul Heart. Sure, Perthrow. Um, that is change. So what we're going to do here is go to that room. So we'll just pop this, cool. 36 coins, nice, nice. Uh, let's keep my eyes open for them tinted rocks. Don't really see any. Ooh, ooh. No, okay. All right, no tinted rocks. For shame, world. For shame. Oh. I suppose it means that it charges faster. Yeah, go on. Go on. We'll take it. We'll take it. We'll take the soul heart as well. And the cursed room could have an item in it. And I, yeah, five coins for a cursed room check is, is worth it to me. You know, assuming we get literally nothing from this. Assuming. And we we gained from going in here, so awesome. Did spend the bomb to get a fairly bad trinket, but 
It's better than having no trinket, and occasionally it's going to make me do more damage. So I'll take it, and I'll be happy about it. No bombs left. We have 16 coins for the next floor. And we have a change, so we can re-roll something that's bad. Probably take that to the deal with the devil over anything. Should have taken that tarot. No, I shouldn't. I've got change. Never mind. Um, yeah, Perthro is going to be good. I forgot to check how far we have to go again. But it's kind of fun not knowing at the same time, isn't it? You know? So, you guys probably checked. I don't know. Maybe you paused it. Or were paying attention, unlike me. Whereas I'm just instantly pressing spacebar and getting the hell out of here. Really dumb damage there. Really dumb damage. You know, whatever. I just didn't have the damage to deal with this room quickly, I don't think. Um, but I could have played a lot better there. And hell, I could have just pressed the spacebar item, you know, and just dealt with it. Woo! Movement speed doing work there. Threaded the needle, that gap. Got some bombs. Good. Needed those. Cool. Alright. Um, so how are we feeling right now in terms of uh, beating this run? Well, let's say if I only have to beat Mom then feeling amazing i'd say based solely on krampus's head i've got that that was really bad damage can we can we not can we not do that anymore please thanks um you're right there you're a little bit scared yeah if we only have to beat mom then everything feels fine to be perfectly honest with you like feels quite strong and especially on krampus's head if i didn't have good damage and i made it to mom's fight just with krampus's head i'd kill her wouldn't i it'd be like a a pretty quick kill i would say um but, I don't think we're going to have to do that based on what someone said in the comments about this challenge run. It's a nice Satan run. So we might have to kill Satan, I don't know. But if we have to get to Mom's heart and defeat Mom's heart, I honestly think because of Krampus' head and our current stats, we'd be fine. Yeah, we could do that. We could totally do that. But, Satan's an if. I don't know. Because I'd get the Krampus' head, right, and I'd use it on one of the phases. What phase is the worst for me? I would say phase 3 is the worst for me. Um, and I think I'm kind of getting the, I've got the hang of, uh, phase two on the Saiyan fight. Phase one's sort of easy, you know, it's just, it's just a fallen fight, you know, whatever. But the longer phase three goes on, the more chances you have of getting fucked up by, uh, you know, the, the, that was a nice bomb. That was quite nice. Um, by the actual, uh, leeches. The leeches are more of a threat than the boss itself and its hooves. Because you're running around, you're running around and you're running away from the hooves. Ah, yes! Massive for me. Awesome. Um, and you're running away from the hooves and you can dodge those, you know? You know where they're going to be. You've got time, you're ready for that. Whereas the silkworms, sorry, the, uh, not silkworms, the leeches, they spawn at pretty much random. You don't know where they're going to spawn. You don't know when they're going to spawn. You could just run into one. You could shoot one. The hoof could land on one and they explode when they die. So it's just, it gets hectic as fuck really fast. Well, our pills have been overall awful this entire run. I'm not going to take Red Candle because I have Krampus' head. We'll take PhD and we'll take the pill. It says up. Yes. That's what I'm talking about. Pheromones. Shouldn't have used that. Shouldn't have used that. Could have rerolled the red candle, I guess, but I don't have the money for it, so whatever. Here's the boss fight as well. There's no item rooms in the challenge run, so don't need to look for that. And in we go. Chub. Hello, Chub. You know what, Chub? I faced Krampus already, so you get a Krampus' head. Go on, then. Have, have it. Have it. Enjoy it. Oh, we're not rerolling that. All stats up. Goodbye, Horror Babylon. We hardly knew you. Uh, and by hardly, we knew you. We've had you for a while. I take that back. Either way, our Babylon was awesome while it lasted. Our damage is going to be way worse now. Jesus Christ. Oh, boy. Ah, I got hit. Well, found a tinted rock. <clears throat> well, you're right there, voice. You okay? Tinted rock had a soul heart in it and a lot of money for the cost of a key. Hang on. I killed these. It blasted me into the next room. I killed them all. What the fuck? Wow. Okay. Guess this is a thing. Just gonna kill him again. But yeah, now my damage is quite bad. Yes, cancer. One of the... I hate that sentence. Seriously. Seriously. Alright, plan made. Plan made. I really need Horror Babylon back. Oh, wow. Okay. Swimming in that money. Could could get Red Candle, but I don't need it. Wow, swimming in that money. But yeah, Horror Babylon. I need it. I want it. Ooh, okay. Alright. Um, sure, I guess. Either way, um, that just sort of puts me very low. Enough to work with. Do I want to be on... No, I'm not going to get that. I'm going to leave that. I want to be for Horror Babylon effective. You know, I want to be doing as much damage as I can, essentially. That would be great. Alright, so we are now on to Depths 1. It does look like currently, based on the map, when I just glanced at it. I finally did look, guys. I finally did it. I looked at what how far we have to go. We are going to have to beat Mum's Heart 100%. But the question is, do we have to beat Satan? And right now, 
I'm thinking, yes, I'm going to need to. I'd take a half heart because, um, you know, I'd be on one full heart and that'd be fine. As Eve, you know, I've got Horror of Babylon, so, you know, I, I only need to be on one heart for Horror of Babylon to be activated. But that will put me to one and a half hearts, which is too much. Too much, I say. So, uh, yeah. Can I wait it out? This is a bit awkward. There we go, finally got him. His positioning was bad, and the, the, the cliff face meant that I couldn't actually shoot him for a while. Could go to the cursed room, I suppose. I'd rather face the boss first, though. Just to make sure that I do have the soul heart protection and all that. 100% for the boss fight. Make sure I get that deal with the devil, because I haven't actually had any, like, significantly good deals with the devil. I've had one, and I took uh, a space bar in, which I've now taken and gone, gone away with. Like, I've left it. It was the head. You know what? Could be an item. Wasn't, but, you know, whatever. Let's do it. I don't mind. Don't mind. I'm feeling, I'm feeling comfortable right now with my damage, and uh, in general this run, so I should be fine, I think. No problems. Cool. Yeah, look at that. I already, I've already dealt with all three phases. No damage was taken. Definitely worth coming in here. I, I figured, I saw the gold chest and I was like, it's gonna be an item. Wasn't, but it was a soul heart. Holy shit, yes. Lots of money there. 100% really worth it. Definitely, that went really well. Careful of the, the bone shots there. It nearly like, you see that? It curved into me almost. Nearly got me. Careful of the champion black version of the exploding flies. It explodes on death. Unlike the normal ones, right? So I've had Perthrow for a while now, and I swear I didn't re-roll. I can't even remember what it was I got on the last floor as the item, but I think I was happy about it. So that's why I didn't re-roll it. Can't even remember. It was only minutes ago. Gone from my memory forever. 15 minutes in and we're on depths 1. We could actually get the boss rush, maybe. I don't know. Uh, don't think I saw a tinted rock in there. It's the gigantic dingle. The dongle. He has to have a deeper voice because he's bigger, right? And then the double dingle. And then the quadruple little poopers, which died instantly. So much that I barely even saw them. There's the shop. Struggling to find uh, the boss fight at the moment. But I need the shop because I got lots of money. And we want to get that, obviously. You're right there, guys. You seem to be running away from me. Fish shot working against me every now and then. Alright, uh, shop time. Yeah, that's a good passive item. I'm not taking the, the bank, obviously, but uh, everything else looks fine. Cool. We got money for the next floor shop as well. There we go. Look, the slow effect is in place. Awesome. That can backfire, I think. I, can, I think it can speed up time as well as slow it down. But uh, overall, it's more helpful than negative, I think. And uh, it's actually saved runs for me and, like, the chest and stuff many times, making the enemies go slower. I believe this is a Krampus' head room. This was. It was. Very careful here. Make sure he stops spawning stuff. Take that soul heart. Don't mind if I do. And deal with the devil should be here now. Come on now. No deal with the devil. But a HP up and a damage up. We need to lose some health here. But it means I can start taking some red hearts again. can go to that cursed room now. And, uh, yeah, we'll go check out the rest of the floor first, though. But, yeah, Horror Babylon's gone, but I got a damage upgrade. So, probably overall, I would say that I barely decreased in damage. But I have de decreased in damage now. Actually, maybe. Maybe um, Horror Babylon and the meat damage modifier is exactly the same. And I've not lost or gained any damage right now. Um... But if I had Horror about Babylon active right now, I think I would probably be doing quite the nice damage. We have the Halo, though, which was really... In fact, we got a lot of amazing items in general. The Mask of Infamy, the Halo. That was it. That was the item I didn't re-roll. The Halo. And, yeah, I didn't re-roll the meat because, you know, obviously, damage upgrade, want it. Uh, sucks that it was a health upgrade for Horror Babylon, but, again, it worked out well. You know, whatever. Cool. Got a few bombs. I think it's definitely worth... Having a look for some black hearts or even some items here since I can get four in one. Got two black hearts and potentially something awesome. Another Perthro. Wow. Hermit card. Yeah, we'll use that. Wait, no, that takes us to the shop we've been there. Never mind. Two of hearts. I guess I'll just get some health back. Whatever. I have the bombs for this. I think it's worth it. Empress card. Halagagagaga. <laughs> That's what it's called, right? The Halagagagaga. Pheromones, Empress card, Hermit card, Her throw. Halagagagagag. It destroys all the rocks in the room. Okay. <laughs> That's what Halagagagagag does. 
Uh, Empress versus Perthro. I would like Empress, but Perthro is too much value for me. So I'll take Perthro. Captile health now, except it's not anymore. But it could be. It could be soon. When we get some soul hearts. Oh. Look up, sure. Tears up. Hell yes. Solid. Worth a black heart. Tears up. Look up. Yes. Yes, yes, yes. Okay, so if we can get back down to one red heart, if we find like an arcade again. Is there an arcade on this floor? No, it's a sacrifice room. Um, yeah, that's really cool that we can uh, get back to Horror Babylon with an arcade. And obviously we can get arcades on many, many different floors in general. Um, that means, uh, yeah, on the womb we can find arcades still. So we should be able to get Horror Babylon back, I think. I think I'm confident in saying that. And yes, look at that. We definitely have to beat Mum's heart. Just not sure on the Satan. But either way, we don't have many challenges left, guys. Um, Suicide King is one. Uh, what's the other ones, actually? Um... Suicide King's one. We have one that we need to unlock by doing Family Man and something else. I think it's Darkness Falls, actually, so I'll have that soon. Uh, didn't even notice you, Super Super Wrath. Thanks for the Mr. Mega, though. There's actually a Tinted Rock in there. Ba -ba -ba boom Yeah, yeah. Gained the bomb back. Got, my, got capped health. Awesome. Please, please, please. Can I get one of them there by arcades? I'd like more damage. Watch it. I suppose I could just, like, let everything hit me and go down to one heart. You know, that would be a viable strategy to get Horror Babylon back. A really stupid strategy, but... Viable. Damn, I thought I might trick him into, like, running into it or something. Didn't. Didn't do that. Guess we'll look in. We got plenty of health. Yes! Oh my god, yes! We've wanted this for so long. Oh, come to me, beautiful pact. Wow, what an amazing run. What an amazing run. It's been so... Wow, the music. The music really slowed down there. I like that. The passive effect from that uh, thing I got from the shop. Um, yeah, that was awesome. That was awesome. I haven't had the pact in so long. I was saying that earlier. I've been, like, missing the pact. You know, it's been a while since I've had it. Um, I'd like to see it again. And here it is. I mean, look at my fucking attacks. They're like... Ignore that sound. They're like a machine gun. And I love when my attacks are like a machine gun. And if we can get more damage upgrades as we go, hell to the yes. Lots of keys. Sure. Plus, we get we gained keys from that on top of the money. Do you have Krampus' said to destroy Mother as fast as possible, which is good. And uh, with our luck upgrade there, it means that the fear effect is actually going to activate more often now. Because that's it does actually have an effect on that, which is really cool. Um, that's going to be our way to kill these guys without too many issues because they're usually very annoying they're running away from us though they're not facing us easy kills uh wow okay unlimited keys not needed bit of a weird room never seen this room before like in one of these doors anyway let's have a look uh damage up challenge up yes i'd also like the other thing as well if we could get the money for that the battery means i could just store more charges for krampus's head and have it whenever i need it essentially Can you just die? Thank you. Being a bit of a pain, that champion there. But yeah, uh, that means more champion enemies. We're already on hard. We're already facing lots of champion enemies anyway. Uh, oh, we're not on hard because it's a uh, challenge mode. Hard is not a thing in challenge mode, apparently. Either way, more champion enemies, so we're basically playing hard mode now. Um, but we got the damage upgrade, which is what I wanted. And I really like champion's belt. Makes me feel like a wrestler. <laughs> so there's the boss fight. Obviously, I don't want to go there until I'm done with the floor. Is there anything else I would like to go do? Yes, I, I want the money for um, the other thing. I can't even remember what it was. What was it? Two of that. Ah, perfect. There's the money that we needed. Wonderful. Two of hearts. Meh. Awesome. So now we can get the thing that's in the shop. that I can't remember what it was, but I know I wanted it. It was, of course... Yes, the overcharge. Awesome. The battery stores energy. And I guess, you know what? We got the money. We'll just go to full health. Whatever. Take the pill as well. We got we got good pills. We need the speed up. Take it. Take it. Take it. Take it. All right. Cool. So this has been an amazing run. Just missed the boss rush, but it doesn't really matter. Uh, we had Perthro. We've had this for ages. We can reroll uh, anything we want. And there we go. She's pretty much lost most of her health now. And we just need to finish the job, I guess. No problem. No problem careful here of the many enemies that she spawns. Blue version spawns many, many enemies. Doesn't really stomp that much. There it is. Got her. Didn't need to buy that soul heart. Uh, I guess if we've got to face the devil, we should take uh, negative, right? That's my second guppy item if I take it. 
I'm going to take it. Take Black Heart as well. Uh, Perthrow is really not seeing any use, is it? We're hanging on, Perthrow. Hang on. Hang in there, bud. Do you want to have a look at my stats? We're not looking at my stats for a long time, have we? Womb time. Uh, yeah, it's all right. If we were in Hall of Babylon, it'd be amazing. We have cancer, so our, our shots are insanely fast. On top of all the tears upgrades we've actually got from the Pact and pills in general. So, everything about this feels pretty great right now. Ha! <laughs> I mean, I'll leave them there so I can go back and get the health if I need to. Doubt I will. Although, having said that, I immediately need to go back there and get that health. Because <laughs> I ran into a shot like a nincompoop. Ah, it could be something. Could be something good. Could be a damage up. Could be a damage up. Do you wanna? Shall I? Shall I? Go on then. Go on then. For you I will. For you I will. Wasn't a damage up. It was the Emperor card. And that's actually really good. I will... I will use it and then come back to this and get Perth throw, I think. So we'll finish this room. Because we're pretty much committed now. I mean, I could use it to get out, whatever. But, uh... You know, I, I feel like we're committed now. We've killed pretty much everything that he has to offer. And we're probably just gonna get an item or something. Okay, this makes me feel like I should have just teleported out. Because <laughs> uh, the first shot on the monster trail can be a bit scary, as you can see. And when there's two of them and you're not sure where they're jumping... Either way, I've killed one already. Who gives a damn? Not me! Yeah, you stay there. Stay there. What'd I get then for all my effort? A key. Not worth it. Ugh! Not seen this in a long time. Either way, it's dead now. Elf up! Uh, I'm going to re-roll that. I'm going to re-roll that. God, we're facing so many monstros in this run. So I want to go back and get Perthrow. And uh, yeah, I'll just do that pretty much. Um, you guys, you guys, fine, we've seen that. Basically, I don't want the health upgrade because it's going to mean I'm going to get further away from my Horror Babylon, which is what I really want. Jesus Christ, my illusion there, my uh, doppelganger, is shooting insanely fast. Is that how fast I'm shooting? Crazy. Thank you, Infamy, for saving the day there. You see that? It stops some damage. Don't have to go too far, and with the Emperor card like that, I can just teleport and then know where I need to go. Um, no, I really don't need that. I really don't need that. Watch it. Got that slow effect. Thank you very much. Passive time stopper watch thing. Any day now, mate. Any day. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Took your time, didn't you? What a jerk. What a jerk. Uh, bomb key, maybe damage upgrade with Cricket's head. Yes. Oh, secret room. I was totally looking for that. Not. Well, I mean, it's just consumables. Whatever. Really annoys me that those explosion barrels are so close to that guy and they do not actually blow him up. I call bullshit on that. All right, Perthro, don't fail me now. Whew, you failed me. You failed me. You, fa you failed me hard, Perthro. You failed me after all that. After all we went through, you know, how long I was saving that, guys. And it gives me a range upgrade. I don't even have coal, you son of a bitch. It was ta it's taunting me, isn't it? That's what it was doing, just taunting me. There we go, that was a pretty quick kill. Really would like to get Horror Babylon. Still looking out for them arcades. Makes me think maybe I should like actually look for them. You know, like look for the whole floor, but I really don't need to, it'd just be nice. But it's gonna be the last floor where I could get an arcade, I suppose, so maybe I should, maybe I should. Whoop, careful, careful. It's a bit of a scary combination there, the ones that shoot in like that everywhere style, and also uh, laser guys. Very scary. That shot a spider at me and I saw the snail effect and was confused by it and got hit because of it. That's bad. Oh well. I mean, I've got the health to get away with it, but let's try not to keep that as a thing, yeah? Let's try not to have that as like a, a thing that I do. That champion has been afraid for so long. Look at him. Poor thing. Doesn't know what's happening. And, wow, tanking hits. Just tanking hits like a champion. I suppose it was a champion enemy. Alright, uh... Okay, there's a boss fight. There's no going back from here. Ah, we're probably not going to find an arcade, are we? Whatever. Boom. That went very well. Let's just finish that. Come on, die. There we go. Alright. Horror Babylon not activating. Is... Are we going to have to go to the Satan land? Is that is that the question? I'm not even, like, focused at all on this fight, because we know the result of this fight. Bit of a dumb dumb damage there, but whatever. What? I don't even know what hit me there. Don't even know what hit me. Whatever. Let's have a look. Yeah, it looks like we have to go down. And I even went into the devil room to do it, 
just because extra style points. Either way, we're already here on the second floor, uh, 30 minutes into the run, is it? Yeah, yeah, about 30 minutes in. It's going very well. The question is, will we make it? Now, we can skip rooms uh, here on this floor. So, you know what? Since this is a horrible room, we're going to go ahead and just get out of there. Never go back. Never go back. Uh, let's not be dumb. There we go. We have the Krampus' head ready to go, and we pretty much always will, I would think. If we get the slow effect on... Oh, we'll just get out of here. Just... Oh. Oh, son of a bitch, I got hit after all that. After all that. Careful. Careful. Very careful. He's really not taking the damage I'd like him to. And I'm going to start using my bombs. I have eight. You know, it speeds the process up, doesn't it? So I may as well. Careful here. All right, cool, cool. Losing health steadily, though. Concerning. I knew they'd get me there. I knew it. I knew it would happen. Didn't even need to use that bomb because I'm killing him now. I'm committed. All right. Uh, losing a lot of health though. Oh god, and we're not gonna make it. We're we not gonna make it. We went the wrong way twice. And again. Oh, there was nothing in here. I wasted a bomb. I just figured I'd just get out of here. So gotta go bottom. Whoa! Never seen that room before, but that was satisfying. That was really cool. I like that. I like that a lot. Careful. Infamy doing work a little bit there. Alright, how do we feel about me being the boss? I'm saving Krampus' head for phase 3. This is fine. I mean, it's an annoying room and I could just leave it, but I, I, I just killed it. It's fine. Um, yeah. Oh, wow, I'm going to have multiple charges of this uh, Krampus' head by the looks of it. That's going to be cool. Look at the amount of fucking shots I'm doing, man. Pay attention to the ridiculous machine gun effect I've got going on here. Oh, look at them. They're trying so hard to shoot, and it's like barely... They're just basically, like, barely spitting it out because of the slow effect. Adorable. All right. Yeah, double Krampus' head. It's going to be great for phase three. I'm just going to murder it. All right. These are fine. Horror Babylon would really help, though. It would try down... Was wrong, and I got hit by myself, my double doppelganger. Damn it. That sucks so hard. We lost a lot of health. We do have a potential revive, but we all know it's not going to work. We all know. There's a tinted rock there. Thank you very much. Yes, good. Ugh, no. Well, we know we're going the right way, so we can skip this room. We can. Just get out of here. And there it is. Just have to get for a fallen, which is not that bad. I said that I can deal with the fallen pretty well, except I got hit. Because I'm a stupid person. Do we have item matter on this run? Or is that... Yeah, we have item matter, right? Damn it. Stop getting hit by those lasers. I'm losing so much health. I'm so afraid. Okay. All right. Here we go. Saving everything for phase three. <clears throat> Good timing. All right. Last bomb. <clears throat> Try and save it. Phase two. Down he goes. Whoa, down he goes. Ah, oh, god damn it, I got hit. Son of a bitch. Okay. Okay. Nearly there, nearly there. Whoa. Nice, Infamy, saving the day there. Thank you very much, Infamy. Don't run into that. Got him. Phase three. Here we go. Okay. Here we go. Krampus' his head. Got another charge to use. Got him. So close. And yes. Oh, thank God for that. We did it. We did it. Darkness Falls. Harder challenge than I thought. Rune of De Gaz. De Gaz. What is that? Rune of the Gaz, guys, let me know what that does. It is unlocked. It's in the runs now. So we have Suicide King. Uh, I have technically beat Cat Got You Tongue. I just thought I did a boss rush and failed it. So I'll do that in my own time. Don't worry. Um, Beans. I came, came close. It was tough. Family Man. We came really close on Family Man. And we have the purest to do, which we'll be doing last. Very excited about that. I think next time I might go for Suicide King. But guys, make a suggestion in the comments for uh, what challenge run you want to see next. Thanks so much for watching. If you enjoyed the video, leave a like. I've been Hollow, you've been you, and I'll see you next time.